morning. Hi, I'm Ian Carlo Rinosa. I'm your property specialist sa Urban Deca. So, lapit po tayo dito. Ito po yung aming scale model. So, ito po yung building na structure ng Urban Deca Homes or Tigas. So, sa ground floor po, as you can see, it's dedicated for parking. So, we have parking sa ground floor. Uh, we have single parking. And we have tandem parking. Doon po yan sa ilalim. So we have, uh, yung, yung building is up to 16th floor. So we have low zone, second floor to fifth floor, uh, mid zone, sixth floor to 10th floor, and yung high zone, 11th floor up to 16th floor. So as you can see, ito po yung mga outer units. We also have inner units here. So mas affordable po yung mga inner units, pero mas maganda yung view ng outer units. We have four elevators per building. So, hindi po tayo makawala ng access kahit masiraan yung ibang elevator dyan. And we have four fire exits as well. So, katabi ang mga elevator. So, now let's go sa ating actual turnover unit. So, this is the actual turnover unit. Fully fitted na siya. As you can see, we have tiles na. So, pag nag-move in po tayo by June, that's three months to go, nakatiles na po yung unit nyo. Okay, so hindi na kayo magpapagawa ng tiles. And malinis na po yung paint, uh, all white. We have two bedroom units. And dito sa bedroom, uh, we have window. Ganyan po yung opening niya for safety and security. And meron na rin lagay ng airbag. So sa kapilang bedroom, ganun din. So we have window and yung lagay ng area. So yung isang room mas malaki lang siya ng slide compared sa isa pang room. Pero they're almost the same. Here sa kitchen we have countertop. So gawa din na tapo niya. Meron na rin storage for cabinet sa ilalim. So ang kailangan niya lang pagawa is yung kitchen cabinet dito. Yung hanging. And sa CR naman or sa bathroom we have naka-install na shower, we have toilet, and sink. So, lagyan na lang na salamin dyan, maganda na. Now, let's uh, pakulita ko sa inyo yung building development plan. So, here is the building plan of Urban Deca Homes Ortigas. We have a total of 22 buildings. So, right now, pre-selling is M&M, move-in ng June. And yung O, move-in po siya ng first quarter of next year. So, this is yung open area. This open area is 1.3 hectares. So, dito ilalagay yung mga amenities like clubhouse, uh, basketball court, man-made lagoon, open gym, open park, and dito magkakaroon tayo ng decamon. So, this whole project will be completed by year 2025, pero as early as this year, move in na tayo sa dalawang building. So, we have few units left sa MNN. Sa O, marami pa, pero ang turnover niya next year pa. So, let's continue here. So, dito naman po, uh, per floor, we have three, I, uh, sorry, uh, we have four three-bedroom units. So, four corner unit po yung mga three-bedroom natin. And the rest are two-bedroom units. Alright, so ito naman po yung aming scale model for the units. So, ito yung two-bedroom. So, ganyan po yung pwede nyong gawin. Uh, meron uh, cabinet dun sa loob ng room may dining and yung living area so same din sa 3 bedroom units Ayan. so now we're here sa aming model unit so ito na po siya, nilagyan na ng gamit para ma-imagine nyo kung ano yung itsura niya kapag uh, finurnish nyo na or kapag nagbumili na kayo ng mga gamit so ito na yung bedroom so kanina walang laman Pero ngayon, meron na siyang queen size bed. And then, maluwag pa yung space niya dito. So, meron tayo dito cabinet. Ayan. So, kahit malaki yung storage, maluwag pa din. And then here, uh, we have a desk. My drawer for extra storage. So, pwede gawing study area or office area. And underneath the bed, we have drawers for maximum storage din. Ayan. So, ma-maximize natin talaga yung space. Kasi marami tayong storage, mga gamit. Okay? So same din sa kabilang room. So yung other room here, same thing. 
Ito naman, single bed. So, mas malood talaga siya. We have accent chair. And, ganun din. May desk din tayo dito. For study area or office. And, marami tayong extra cabinet and closets. Ayan, for extra storage. Ayan. So, kayo na bahala mag-design kung paano gusto nyong uh, gawa or model dito sa cabinets. So, yun po. So, ito uh, naman po yung kitchen. So, as you can see, dun sa kabila, isang diretsyo lang siyang ganun. Dito, in-extend lang. So, nag-extend lang ng konti dito para meron tayong extra patungan and extra storage din sa ilalim for our kitchen utensils. So, sa taas naman, pwede mga display yan ng mga gamit sa kitchen. So, dito yung space ng refrigerator. Ito may sink natin. And yung iba ang ginagawa, naglalagay ng washing machine dito. So, yung front load na washing machine, yung automatic, i-elevate na lang ng konti itong countertop. And that's it. So, here naman sa dining, uh, four-seater yung nasa ating model unit. Hindi siya nakasagad sa wall, pero maluwag pa din. So, hindi siya nakadikit sa wall. And because of the mirror na malaki, and yung magandang lighting, talagang sobrang luwag na yung tingnan. Maaliwalas. Hindi siya madilim tingnan. And yung CR natin, sobrang ganda na niya. Uh, may mirror na. Uh, meron na rin storage dito sa ilalim ng sink. And meron na rin glass divider. So, pakita mo glass divider. Ayan. So, may glass divider. May mga design na rin doon sa may toilet area. And, again, ito yung living room. So, sa likod ng pintuan, meron tayong extra space. So, dito usually may console table and yung TV natin. So, pwede rin maglagay dito ng mga uh, hanging cabinet pa for additional decorations. If gusto nyo para mga additional decorations. So, yun lang po. Thank you so much for uh, watching and have a great day. Bye-bye.